today we are continuing with the revisit of the Walking Dead game. In the last episode, we learned the truth about the St. John Dairy Brother Farmer Cannibal people. Um, so they basically chopped Mark's legs off and tried to feed them to us. So we are now stuck in a meat locker. We need to try and find a way out and regroup with the rest of our group. Uh, Alright guys, so with that said, let's get right into it. Dad. Come on, Larry. Do you really want to attract their attention? Yeah, I want to attract their attention. So I can fucking kill them! Guess your new girlfriend wasn't all she was cracked up to be. What the hell is your problem? You refused to give me my day's rations back at the motor lodge. And you went out of your way to be an asshole to me tonight. You must really hate me. But guess what? You're stuck with me. I plan to be around long after you're gone. And if you turn, I'll be the one to put the axe through your skull. Dad! Open up, goddammit! No, you're not worth the energy to hate. Don't forget, I know who you really are. I'll, I'll break that damn door down! Dad, you can't get... Uh, uh, Easy! Uh, oh, God. Dad? No! Dad, come on! Dad! Oh, God. He stopped breathing. I think he's had a heart attack. Shit. Is he dead? He's not dead! Somebody help me! If he's dead... He's not dead! What has to happen, Lee? Think about it. You saw that poor bastard at the motel? How fast he turned? What are you saying? Lily, I'm sorry. I truly, truly am. But in a few minutes, we're gonna be stuck in a locked room with a six-foot-four, 300-pound, seriously pissed-off dead guy. Fuck you! We can bring him back! Lee! We'll mourn him later. But right now, we have to keep him from coming back. No! God damn it, Kenny! He is not dead! Maybe you're right. No, god damn it! My dad survived worse than this! Look, Kenny, back at the drugstore when we all thought Duck was bitten, I gave him the benefit of the doubt. Maybe we should do the same now. That was different. Duck wasn't bitten. But come on! We know this guy's not gonna make it. Remember what Ben said. Gotta destroy the brain. Come on, Lee. You can't be in the middle on this one. You gotta have my back this time. God damn it, Lee. I need you. Please help me. Come on, Dad. Come on. Wake up. Wake up. Come on. You're right, Kitty. Let's get this you over. You fucking monsters! Both of you! I don't want to see. I'm sorry, Lily. No, no, no! It's the only way. <laughs> Get off me! Don't do this! No! No, no, no! Let go of me! No! Please! No! why we had to do this, Clementine. So we won't turn into one of those monsters? That's right. <laughs> I know. I know. But you gotta be strong right now. I need you to be strong. Think about something else. Something hopeful. Like what? Someplace safe where no monsters can get you. We're gonna get out, right? You found a way out? I'm working on it. You, uh, you think maybe we were too hasty? 
Only one important thing right now. Getting the fuck out of here. We did what we had to. It's just you and me. Lily's in no condition to help us rescue your family. Considering what just happened, she probably sided with the St. John's against us. Lily, I'm, I'm sorry. Don't talk to me, Lee. Don't fucking talk to me. I know you hate Kenny and me too, but he did what he had to so we can all go on living. For what? He's got his family, and you've got Clementine. I've got nothing. You left me with nothing. There ought to be an air duct behind this unit. Maybe big enough for one of us to fit through. I don't know, Lee. Seems like a long shot. Does the air conditioner come off? I think I could take it off. If I had something to remove the screws. The multi-tool. Of course they took it. Shit. Maybe there's something else we could use. I've got a rock. Ah, a rock won't help. But a coin might do the trick. Do you have a coin? Uh-uh. -uh. Not coming off that way. Get away. I just need to. I told you to get the fuck away. Why can't you just leave me alone? I'm sorry, Lily. But if we're gonna get out of here, we need your help. And Larry's. I think I may have found a way out of here. But I need something to remove the screws on the air conditioner. If you had something I could use as a screwdriver, a coin or something... No. What about him? Look, I know this is a terrible time for it, but uh, back at the motor inn, Larry... Larry mentioned something about keeping coins in his pockets. In other words, my father's more useful to you dead than alive. If he was alive and had the key to getting us out of here, do you think he'd keep it to himself? What do you want? My blessing to loot his corpse? Your permission. <sighs> do what you have to do. idea which pocket he keeps his change in? You fucking vulture! A ring. My mother's. Don't worry. I'm not taking it. Here we go. Two quarters. And a dime. Yeah, one more should do it. Well, there's our way out, Lee. We don't know where it leads. Looks like it'll probably lead right into that back room. I, I can find out. It's okay to be scared. We need you, Clementine. <sighs> okay. You're gonna be fine. What do I do when I get out? See if you can get to the other side of that door and open it. Thank you. 
Let me. Gotta go. Leave me alone. Lee, I can see him. It's not safe in here. For God's sake, Lee. Didn't even get to say goodbye. Get in here. I got an idea. Stay here. Take care of Lily, okay? I will. Slaughterhouse. Ugh, I don't think I'm gonna be sick. Oh my God, what's wrong with these people? Jesus, this is where they butcher people. So what's the plan? That dumbass is so caught up in his own rant that we could probably sneak right up on him. Just stick behind me in case anything goes down. When we get to the front, grab his gun. Sounds good. Okay, you ready? Yeah, let's go. Stay close. Outside the barn. Oh shit! Just guarding the place like you said. Well, sitting out in the rain up the damn gear. Mama says we can't keep that many folks alive and not expect trouble. Pick one to keep and kill the rest. And I pick each one to keep alive. Not the kid. I'm gonna lead on the trail. What's he doing in there? This is my favorite part too. When I let one think they can just walk right out, <laughs> take him out together. Yeah. He's gonna walk past us to get to the lead Take him out when his back is to us. See what he's doing now. What's he doing? I don't see him anymore. Where the fuck did he go? I don't know. Look again. He didn't go past us. See where he is now. can live. That's why you killed that woman in the woods. She was about to spill everything. You weren't ready to hear yet, Lee. Had to stop her. You gotta keep me alive. If you kill me, the meat gets tainted. You can't eat it. You're already tainted. You ain't gonna kill me. Just like he didn't kill Jolene. You don't have what it takes. <laughs> This is not how the world works now. You won't make me kill you! 
Fuck you, Mead. You and Kenny murder my dad, but you leave this piece of shit alive? Fucking asshole. Oh god, don't hurt him! That's Katja! Please, no! Lily, please, keep her safe. as we were coming up to the house. They attacked us! I knew it. I told you we couldn't trust them. Shit. How many of them are there? Two left. Where? Larry's dead. They chopped off Mark's legs and tried to feed them to us. Shit. Is everyone else okay? They've still got Duck and Katja in the house, and I don't know where the fuck Kenny is. All right. We're coming in to help. The main gate is too dangerous. Go around the fence and see if there's a back way in. I'll keep looking for Kitty. Do you have a weapon? I don't leave home without it. Ben, stick close. And Lee, be careful. <laughs> 